Okay. Yeah, no, um, they reached out to me. It, you know, it was, a, it was a great day. It'd been 17 years since I've been on the show. And uh, so, yeah, I remember it like it was yesterday. It wasn't too long ago. And I was in the kitchen there and my text started going off. And I looked down and it was Mark Tester from ABC. And I was like, wow, I kind of knew what was, I was excited because I knew he wasn't just calling me to say hi. And uh, that's, that's kind of how it came about. And they said, hey, would you be interested in coming back? And I said, yeah, I'd love to. Well, you know how that is, buddy. I, uh, uh, you know, we don't, we never really talk about storylines, things like that. But all I can tell you is um, Taggart's back. Mm-hmm, yep. Well, I need to kick his butt, you know. I've been I've been training training hard, you know, like getting ready for the it's like the thriller in Manila, but uh yeah, you know, um I'm you know, honestly, Jared, I'm excited to take the character wherever you know, Frank and the writers decide that they want him to go because they have such great insight and vision. And I'm just always excited to see what the next script is because, you know, my job is really to bring that to life, to bring those words to life. So, um, you know, they're doing such an amazing job. To me, it's like, um, you know, there was a time in my career when I would like, think like that you know hey I want this to happen or hey I want this to happen but now I, I I like to be more in the moment and say what do they got next for me what's where is he going to go this way you know and that way it's like just as exciting for me as, as it is as for 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 you guys you know what I'm saying Correct. Yeah, no, that was really a blessing and I, I will never be able to repay them because it's truly one of those, you know, magical moments where the fans really were responsible for, you know, bringing Taggart back, you know, and why I'm here today. You know, now, um, obviously, you know, Frank and, and the producers and writers have the final decision. So I go kudos to them as well and credit to them to, to listen and to be open to that because they don't have to, you know, they, they, they're, they're doing the best and they do an amazing job at um, doing what they believe is going to help the show to stay on um, for a long time. And so I have mad respect for that. So I'm grateful to everybody. Yeah, that's a great question. It's like, it's kind of like, it's not that we grew close or we even stayed connected, but we never grew apart. And I'm talking about Maurice. Me and Maurice have been friends forever. Like, you know, he was the best man in my wedding and stuff like that. But um, when we parted our different ways, um, you know, we didn't really talk for 17 years. And it was kind of weird because it wasn't on purpose. Like he was reaching out to me. I was reaching out to him. We had the wrong phone numbers. And he's thinking he's thinking that I'm not returning his call. I'm thinking he's not returning my call. And then his wife decided to become an agent, thank God. And she reached out. She, I was the first person that she reached out to. And, um, you know, the rest is history. So now we're back connected and, and it's awesome. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. 
Yes, I do. Uh huh. We just, uh, I, it's my third season, but this is the 3.0 where I'm really like, you know, doing it right. And, you know, I kicked it off with Maurice and Steve and, you know, I'm going to have a lot of powerful women coaches on there and I'll have other actors on there as well. But it's really about empowering women and, and empowering us to be able to know that we can be the best version of ourselves and that we can get through challenges, you know, because a lot of time I like to, to, to have powerful coaches in there, but also obviously my acting friends, because a lot of people look at us and they think it's all rosy and a great road and it's not. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Uh, yeah, like the rocky road, man. Uh, there's been more bumps than I can ever imagine, but you know, it, it makes us who we are, Jared. And, uh, you know, I'm grateful for those bumps. There was a time where I looked at them as not good things, but now I look at them as great things because that's what makes us who I, we are, you know? But, oh yeah, there's been a lot of bumps. <laughs> Oof, I don't know, dude, because she's a feisty one, you know. Um, but I'm excited to see, you know, where it goes. I, you know, obviously I was bummed, you know, I didn't get to, to, to do the re reunion scene, but I'm grateful that, you know, um, Champion was able to step in and, you know, um, you know, cover for me. And, you know, it's a time that we all, there's a lot of stuff going on and we just got to all make sure that we're healthy and take care of each other. So, but I, I look forward to um, the next scenes. Uh, a little scared because Trina, is, she's a little pissed off right now, but you know, it'll be good. Yeah. Oh yeah. You think it'll be good. Yeah. That's awesome, buddy. Yeah, so tell your dad I appreciate him as a, uh, you know, the support on our show and stuff like that. So we appreciate that. Yeah, third cast, I'd love to have you on the show. Um, you know, uh, yeah, I'll reach out to you and stuff like that. And I just want to say I'm proud of you for how old are you? 13. I, I appreciate people to step up and I'm not going to ask you those questions now because I'll ask you that on my podcast. But, um, you know, I'm honored that you had me on here. And if there's anything I can do, you let me know. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. Hey, uh, how are you? Good. So I hear you've been watching the show for a long time, huh? <laughs> nice. Well, listen, your son's quite a champion. I'm very proud of him and uh, that he's stepping up and doing this. But uh, 
it was great to meet you and, and I appreciate you and continue to watch. We've got some great stuff coming up, okay? Uh, yeah, well, you know, we, we never talk about storyline, but it's all good. And I'm grateful that, you know, um, somebody was able to step in. And as I was sharing with your son, it's, it's a delicate time right now. But we got to do what we got to do to make sure we're all safe and healthy, right? You too, buddy. All right, I'll say hi to Maurice for you. And, and Anger Boy, see, they're both here. Look, there's Anger Boy. Yeah. No, no, the very first thing ever came out of my mouth was Anger Boy. And when I got shot, I called him Anger Boy. We call, you know, I, I still call him Anger Boy. He's always going to be Anger Boy. All right. Thank you, brother. I appreciate you. God bless. All right. All right. God bless, Jared. Take care, man.